guys, it's Cheryl the Craft Nut 32 and I'm here today to make a masculine card. This card is going to be a welcome baby card or a congratulations card. Some friends of ours have just had a baby so I'm wanting to make a card. I have a little something I want to drop off for them. So what I'm going to do is I start off with this piece of cardstock. It is six by four and a half. I'm going to do a nice background scene so I'm pulling out some sticky notes. And what I'd like to do is just um, use some distress inks and kind of create like some grass and sky. So I am just kind of placing it and I'm going to mark with my pencil just an area that I'd like to cut out so that way I can come in with my distress inks and shade it up. So I'm just moving it over so I can get roughly where I want the height of the hill to be. So what I'd like to do is just kind of have like a hill and the bottom half a green and then have a nice sky and I've cut out with my silhouette um, a nice clothesline and some little onesies. So I'm going to peel it off, grab some scissors and cut it out. Something just like this. So I have the top parts right here that I can just grab for the next round. I'm going to pull out a different mat. And for this card I'm going to be using broken china and tumbled glass. the green portion and I'm going to be using mowed lawn and shabby shutters. So now I'm going to grab my cuddle bug and I'm going to cut this down using a stitched border die, just kind of like that. While I have it out, I'm also going to cut some little hearts with this Lawn Fawn die. And that stitch border die was also from Lawn Fawn. So I'm going to run that through also. in there. So next I'm going to assemble my card. I have this really cute clothesline and then I have these little onesies. 
I have cut out using my silhouette and I really like that it came with the little clothes pegs that are just off camera right over there. I'm going to be using some Tombow multi-adhesive for this and here we go. Using some Mermaid Lagoon and I'm just going to distress the edges of the onesies. The card is looking super sweet. I'm just going to add a sentiment and then add it to the front of the card. And so I thought this stamp set from Simon's Stamp, it is the handwritten borders, Welcome Baby, would be perfect for this card. And I haven't used it yet. This is the first Welcome Baby card I have made in quite some time. So I'm really happy to pull some of these things out. So I think I'm going to have it just like that across the bottom. I'm going to use my Fisker stamp press. I'm going to move this out of the way. Line this up as much as possible. Press that down. Kind of get an idea of where I would like it on the card. Across the bottom. So today, my ink, I'm going, for my ink, I'm going to use um, some Memento Tuxedo Black ink. I'm going to ink up the bottom of this stamp. Make sure I don't have any ink on my fingers. I'm horrible for that. Lining it, up, line it up on the grid. Give it a nice, good push down everywhere. And that looks so cute. I love it. So I have these little hearts here that I cut out with this Lawn Fawn heart die. And I'm just going to place some around the card. And if anyone is curious, it was a little boy that they had. So hence all the blue. And I love adding these little hearts wherever possible. I think I have them on every card I've done for the last little while. Cover up that little dot. I'm not sure how that happened. And another one right over there. And I think just like that. You know what? I think that's kind of a lot. I'm going to take away this one, I think, and this one. I think it's kind of like that, actually.
And then even though it's a mail card, I always think you can add glitter. And this is the Studio G glitter from Michaels. And then one final touch for the front of the card, I'm going to use some Wink of Stella on the onesies. Now I'm going to adhere it to the card front. I'm going to pull out my ATG gun and I'm just going to apply a ton of glue. And I'll give it a good solid push down once everything is dry. But that is it. That is my Masculine Monday card welcome baby for this week. I love how it turned out and I hope that you have enjoyed watching this video. I hope you have a great day and thanks for watching. Bye!